today our lesson is about phrasal verbs has anyone heard of these before one no not heard of them yeah okay well let's have a look together shall we okay so phrasal verbs what do you think a phrasal verb is can you put your hands up you think you know Anyone? No? Do they sound a bit scary? <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. Then. don't worry. We'll, we'll learn about them. They won't be scary. So, what is a phrasal verb? So, a phrasal verb is the pairing of a verb the pairing of a verb with another word or two. So it's a verb plus another word. Okay? Does that make sense? Yeah, I did. Yeah? Okay, well, we'll learn more about it, so we'll understand them, don't worry. Yeah. Okay, so a phrasal verb, it provides more information than a verb on its own. So when we add another word to it, it gives us more information we can understand better about what's happening. Is that okay? Yeah? I get it now. You get it now, that's good. <laughs> okay then, awesome. Does anyone have any questions? Any questions? Senator, do you have a question? No, teacher. No. Okay then, that's all right. Let's carry on then. Okay, so first I've got a video for you. So this will help to explain it a bit better. So let's check out this video. Okay then. Let's have a look. Oh, well done, Kalinsa. Yeah. yeah. Very good, Ekmali. I know the answer, but I don't know how to draw them. That's okay. That's okay. You could just draw what you like, what you think. Let's it's add a something. race. Ooh. It's a race. One gives. Oh, I see, Sadaham. Very good. Let's add some more pins. Everyone, you holding your pictures up? Senator? Yeah? See? Very yeah, good. Oh, well done. Um, let's have a look. Very good. Oh, I love these drawings. They're really good. Well done, everyone. Receipt, Udara. Do you have any pictures for us? No? I don't know how to draw it. Okay, that's all right. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> you can draw whatever you like. It doesn't matter. Okay, yeah, so. I know the answer, but I can't, I don't know how to draw that. That's all right, that's all right. It's just a bit of fun. So, okay, so now we have three possible meanings for to give up. So what I want you to do, I want you all to tell me if you think, is it A, B, or C? What does it mean? Does it mean to admit defeat? To give something in an upwards direction? Or to call a sheep? Which one do you think? So, A, to dress in pajamas. B, to dress in smart or formal clothes. Or C, to leave the house. I think this B. Me. Okay then. Oh, look, who thinks is A? Sounds exciting. Join us today for more details. Call zero double seven triple nine five seven eight zero.